Good morning. The thing that is on my mind this morning is connections and specifically how important it is to build connections with everyone we serve, whether it's someone in our family, someone who we're selling to in our business, or vendors who support us in our businesses. I have had so many LinkedIn direct messages lately where people just automatically try to sell me something the second we're connected and sometimes through in messages before they even know anything about me. And I am just completely turned off by that. And I'm guessing you probably are too. And yet there's some lesson in there around what am I really doing to build connection with the people that I serve and can I do more to build stronger connections? Just being really thoughtful about what could their problems be? What could the things that they need help with be? And how can I help to support and serve them is such a great way to enrich your life and create those strong connections that are going to have them think of you when they need whatever product or service it is that you are providing. When I think about how this relates in our personal lives, I'm thinking about my granddaughters. So my granddaughters are eight and 13 and you know, as you start hitting the teenage years, it gets harder and harder to have thoughtful conversations with them. I'm going to share with you a fun thing that I have done with them. And then on the back end of the video, if you want to watch a couple of videos about them as we have our fun conversations, those will be there for you too. So Stacy Siegman has um, this really cool product and it's called Heart Illusion. And you get this little heart and inside when you open it up, there are words that you pick out. And uh, each one of them is different. So like this one that I picked out says one of a kind. So what I do with my granddaughters is each time they come over, they pick a word and then they tell me what that means to them and what they think about that word. And it just creates some amazing conversations. So my thought for you today is this really think about how you're building connections both in your personal life and in your business life and how can you serve those people more strongly who you are connected to and who you're building relationships with because this is how we rise. For those of you who want to stick around for the next two minutes you will see a video of Jocelyn and Elena picking a word from the heart and our conversation around their thoughts. And below you will find a link where you can contact Stacy if you'd like to get a heart of your own. I am here with Jocelyn and we have a heart. Can you show them the heart, Joshy? And pull out a word. We got this from Stacy mm -hmm. at Balanced Body Reflections. And pick a word, Josh. And what is the word? Balance. The word is balance. And so what does balance mean to you? To always balance everything in your life, to have fun, like have some time with family and work. I like it. Mm -hmm. And what do you do to balance your life? Mm -hmm. Spend time with you while doing schoolwork. I kind of like that. In fact, I like it a lot. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Jocelyn. I love you. I love you too. Okay, now I am here with Bug. Bug, can you pick a word out, please? Sure. Let's see what word you have. I have... Just pick one. Okay. Star. Stronger. So, hold this in your hand and tell us what you think of when you think of being stronger. Look at the camera. What I think of being stronger is like working really hard. Yeah? And something that you earn like super high for. Yeah? What makes you stronger, Bug? Uh, being with my family and helping them out when they need it. I like that. All right. Can you tell everybody to have a strong, a strong day? Have a strong day. Okay. Bye. Bye. <laughs>